friends, it's Miss Brandy. How are you today? Um, I thought maybe I would make Miss Christie's bubble recipe today and we could see how it worked. So it only takes a few ingredients. You just need some water, which I already have my water already measured and in my cup. A little bit of sugar and then some dish soap. So I have everything measured and I'm going to mix it all the way Miss Christie's recipe said and we're going to see what happens. So to my water, I'm going to add my sugar in, and then we're going to mix it. So I'm gonna put the lid on my cup so that nothing falls out while we're mixing. And I'm gonna shake it up a little and try to get all of that sugar. See the sugar at the bottom? We're gonna shake it until we don't see all of that sugar anymore. We want it to dissolve in our warm water. So let's see, we're gonna give it a minute and let it spin. And as it spins, you can see that the sugar is almost gone. So one more shake, I think, is all we're going to need. So we're going to shake it up again. We're going to look for the sugar. And I think we're good. So now we're going to add our dish soap. So we're going to be very careful. This is pretty slippery. So we're going to add our dish soap in. And then I'm going to very carefully mix it again. See what happened to my water? So my water was clear even when I put my white sugar in it, but now that I added my dish soap, it turned blue the same color as my dish soap. So I'm gonna shake this really carefully because the dish soap makes lots of bubbles. And I don't want too many bubbles in there before we try to blow bubbles with our solution. Okay, so I did not have a bubble wand, so I thought I would try two different things to see if they work. The first thing I'm going to try is just a straw. I'm gonna just dip this straw in the bubbles and we're gonna hope that it blows us a nice big bubble. Okay, are you ready? Let's see what happens. Hmm, I think I need a little more in my straw. Let's try again. See if we can get some in there. Okay. Ooh, we have a little bubble. Let's see if we can try one more time and get a bigger bubble with our straw. Here we go. I don't know, guys. Let me see. Okay, maybe a straw is too little. So I wasn't sure what else to use because I don't have a bubble wand. Mm, just some little bubbles. So this time I'm going to try a water bottle. And all I did was take the cap off and I used some scissors. So if you need to use scissors, you'll have to have mom or dad help you to see if this will blow us a big bubble. Okay, here we go. Hmm. Let's try again. Wow, did you see how big that bubble was? So, I learned today that the straw maybe is too little to blow bubbles with this bubble solution, but you can definitely blow a big bubble with your water bottle. I hope that is something that you can try with your family. Bye guys, have a great week.